Just moments ago, NASCAR announced the Daytona 500 has been delayed. Xavier Walton joining us live from Daytona International Speedway. Say it ain't so, Xavier. Good morning. Unfortunately, Hannah, that's the news we just got within the last 15 minutes. And he, listen to this. You know, this actually marks the third time in the last five years weather has impacted the Daytona 500. So you just said it. Uh, the race now being postponed until 4 o'clock Monday. That's tomorrow. But certainly uh, the rain not entirely uh, dampening everyone's spirits. We've been out here the last 20, 30 minutes in the rain. Uh, we made some new friends here at the Bistro. They're going to wave at everybody. There we go. So there's a prime example of the rain not completely killing everyone's spirits. A lot of people still wanting to have fun, but I'm going to set the scene. You got a thumbs up here with a guy in a, in a poncho protecting himself in the rain. Um, but out here, as you look at the, the grandstand and everything around it, I mean, completely empty, extremely gray um, everywhere you look. And this is what we were worried about as we left here last night. And, and even some of these uh, businesses, um, where you would normally get food. They've already closed up shop. Employees have already uh, started going home. Now, earlier, I was driving around. I wanted to, to get a real feel, a real flavor for how the fans were reacting. I said, hey, you know, yay or nay, is this race going to happen? Obviously, this news is uh, reverberating around the entire uh, Daytona International Speedway now. Uh, one lady, you know, extremely optimistic, saying it was going to happen. Obviously, it's not now. Uh, another gentleman literally, you know, looking um, at his radar, getting minute-by-minute minute updates. And, and that's the, the sort of thing that you're seeing out here. I mean, there were even, you know, gentlemen that I spoke to who said, you know, I really, really hope it's today or even tonight. And why is that? Because, hey, tomorrow may be a holiday with President's Day, but not everybody necessarily um, can take President's Day off. Some people have to work. And then I also spoke to another group. I literally rolled up to them in my vehicle, in my car. I rolled down the window. I said, Hey guys, you know, yay or nay, what do you think is going to happen? And this was before the announcement, Henna. They actually packed up their stuff and they said they were driving back to New Jersey 18 hours today because they just had a feeling, looking at the forecast, that the race wasn't happening and they couldn't stay until Monday to wait for it to, to start. That's probably so disappointing for so many people who have to leave because they don't have off tomorrow. Well, Xavier, please stay dry. Thank you so much. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.